friends. Welcome back to Rachel in the Highlands. I'm so glad that you joined me today. So today I am going to reveal to you our powder bathroom and I'm super excited to share that with you. It has been quite the process to get this finished. If you follow along on this journey, welcome back. Thank you for joining me. <laughs> we have been so busy getting it ready. I had a deadline, we finished it. I'm so excited about that. And then I'm gonna show you how you like walk into our bedroom, how you can see the layout, cause I had some people question on that. And I just wanted to give you the fill for the room. But before I do jump into that, I wanted to share with you a little bit of what I have been going through the last couple months. I haven't been posting as much. Back in the spring, I was diagnosed with breast cancer and it has been such a challenging time in my family's lives and mine. Um, I'm on the other side of it now, as far as I've had surgery, one month post-surgery, I can move my arms a little higher. I did um, have a bilateral mastectomy and whoa, that's no joke. <laughs> it was very intense and painful and I'm so glad that I'm on the other side because yeah, that was a very hard time in our lives. I'm thankful for my nurse, my husband, he did, I had four dreams and he was there constantly by my side. My friends and family, they loved us through this process. So it has just been such a hard time and I haven't really done a lot of thrifting. Obviously, I've been preoccupied with going to the doctors, getting diagnosed, figuring out what I had, getting surgery, and getting you know that ball rolling. <sighs> now I can feel like I can breathe. I don't have any doctor appointments this week, which is amazing because it has been months since that has happened. And I'm starting to feel normal. If you have breast cancer or know somebody that has had breast cancer, then you know how challenging this is and the journey you have to walk through. I'm just glad that we found it and I'm on the other side of it. So that's where I've been. Um, so if you are still here hanging around, thank you very much. I am going to try to get back into doing videos. Now I cannot promise you that I will do them all of the time because it just depends on whether I have the physical ability to do them or also the headspace to do them. It takes a little of both. Now I have been thrifting, but just, but not that much. I mean, we would stop after a doctor's appointment and I would run in to get my mind off things and grab up maybe a beautiful piece here and there. So in time, I will show you my collection that I have been collecting over the last few months. But I wanted to show you the powder bathroom. So once I got my diagnosis, it literally was a closet and we had just no toilet in our bathroom. You know, we did our primary bathroom with our walk-in shower, no space for a toilet. So once I got my diagnosis, I was like, honey, I'm sorry, I'm gonna have surgery. I need a toilet in my room. And he understood and being the thoughtful, wonderful man that he is, we went ahead, we gutted it. I will show you that process. Oh, I absolutely despise ripping things out, but we gutted it, we uh, restained the floor. So we were able to keep the wood floors. We placed in the toilet um, sink. I love having it in my room. I missed my toilet. <laughs> I know. Really, I really did though. Jump in, I'm gonna show you what we did. Guys, thank you so much for always sticking with me, for reaching out, telling me you missed me. I really appreciate it. I love reading your comments. You know, I always try to comment back to each one of you. So do me a favor, like and subscribe. Leave me a comment down below. Take care friends and I'll be back soon. This is our master bathroom that we just finished. And here, is the powder bathroom, which is just going to be the toilet and vanity. We're going to try to keep the original wood floors. Eventually, 
we were thinking fall we were going to redo our floor but we'll sand and stain this if we can keep it husband doesn't know yet toilet will go here this was a closet with a built-in tiny closet so we're going to do toilet and i already have the vanity to go here i'm on the hunt for the perfect mirror in sconces we have three and a half weeks to get this done we will do it three and a half weeks we can do this